doesn't this look great? This is on the menu tonight. Uh, Saturday night? Well, it's got to be, hasn't it? This is something special. Kebabs. So let me show you the way I've been making these for years. And years. Years. Now, let me show you the ingredients that we're going to need for tonight's meal. Mainly, this is a lovely piece of meat. It's shoulder of lamb. I'm going to trim the fat off and cut it into cubes about one to one and a half inches, not too small. We're going to need onions, tomatoes, mushrooms, lemons, a red bell pepper, and a green pe bell pepper, and some olive oil. Now I'm going to cut this meat into cubes, not too small, just to give you an idea about this size. And we can cut the peppers into cubes as well. And the onions. Now we take a bowl, like this one, in we go with the lemon juice. And olive oil. Then in we go with the meat. Look at all that lovely lamb. And the peppers. Mm, not that bad. And onions. And mushrooms. Mix this around. And we're going to leave this for about an hour to marinate and get some of this um, lemon juice and olive oil flavours into, into everything. And it's as simple as that really. So we come back in about an hour's time. Now we have to get on with the more tedious job of putting our meat and peppers and everything onto these kebab skewers. Now when I do this, I always tend to start with a piece of onion and face it inwards. It sort of traps everything really. And then you need a piece of meat, and you need a piece of pepper, and another piece of pepper, and a mushroom, and some onion, and you keep going until they're all done. So I'll see you a bit, I'll see you a bit later on. Now I did find that the mushrooms kept splitting. I think the, the kebab skewers a little bit wide. So I'm gonna put these on separately. And also we've got some leftover pieces of meat and, and onion, and I'll scatter, scatter these about. And when it comes to the tomatoes, I'll put them on after this has been cooking for a little while because they seem to cook a lot faster. I might as well put a lemon on there. They always cook really well, taste good. Now we can put these into the grill part of our oven now that they're ready. Then to cook and give them a turn every now and again so they get done all the way around. Keep the, uh, keep the grill on the highest heat and then uh, you'll get a nice sort of caramelisation over the meat. Okay, so it's time to check these out. Good. I'll give these a turn and put the tomatoes on. If you can hear something boiling away, it's because I've got the rice on the go as an accompaniment. So let's try a piece of this delicious lamb kebab. Oh, that is really tasty. Mmm, that is so nice. I bet you'd like to try some. Mmm, that was tasty. And that is the end of another video. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope if you're not subscribed to this channel, you will subscribe. And um, to all my subscribers out there, thank you so much for staying with me. And uh, any comments, please leave them down below. And I shall see you again at the next video. Bye.